Let's go. B. Damn, B. You blessed up. They telling me the child, but I for real don't know what that is. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Yeah. Got a mink coat, damn near, sitting on the floor With a bad bitch, she got a 4-5 up in the drawer Never satisfied, something always tell me I need more What's the dealio, Martilio, man? You know it's your boy Jocelyn, right? Who you want to get back, Jocelyn? I just pulled up Hellcat, man, you need to run You see my smoke? Y'all, it is freezing outside today. Literally freezing outside today. But what's the deal, y'all? I'm coming to y'all with another banger video, man. And I might as well throw the gun range into the gun collection video. You know what I'm saying? So th this is what's about to happen. I'm about to move my car outside real quick first, okay? So I'm about to move my car outside real quick, y'all. And then put my gun in the trunk and stuff. Because we are going to a gun range. Because literally the only ammo you can find right now is like green tips. So, it's some gun ranges that let you shoot green tips. So, my stepdad found one, but I'm about to go to the gun range I normally go to. Ask if I can shoot green tips there. If I can't, I'm going to my stepdad's and all that. But I'm about to move my baby outside, and then we about to hit the road and go, y'all. So, stay tuned. Smash the like button right now, because you already know this video going to be a banger, y'all. And let's get it. I just came back from the gun store, right? Well, this the gun range I go to, I went and asked if I could shoot my green tips in there because like I said, that's literally the only ammo you can find. And they said I couldn't in that one. So I'm gonna go to the one my stepdad told me that he shot his at. And I decided I got him this new hand guard. So I got him this hand guard. This is Christmas gift and I got this shirt for me. You feel me? Extra small because I am small, but this boy cold, so I got this for me because look, Christmas tree. I'm gonna wear that tomorrow. No cap. So y'all right now I'm about to go to this other gun range that my stepdad went to and hopefully I can shoot my baby there. So let's get it. Boom. Alright y'all, I'm here and let's see what they say. <laughs> All right, yeah, so I'm just trying to zero it in right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get the middle. It's in the middle, but the sight got to go up a little bit. That's what this is for. So we're zeroing that in right now. So we're doing like three to what? Uh, you know, just to get the shots. All right, y'all, so I think I got it centered down. I wish I ain't come by myself. Someone could record me, but we'd be all right. These boys just flying all on me and jump like Dang, get, get back in there. So I think I got it zeroed in because I was aiming at the middle. It was hitting in the middle, a little bit above, all that stuff. As long as it stayed in the middle and not sideways, it's good for me. Okay, I'm gonna try again. Oh yeah. You see them boys just flying and hitting me? Last four bullets. So these last four, we're gonna see. Well, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna shoot once and see, cause I don't want to waste this. I want to make sure it's zero. Then, for real, for real, y'all. Right, let's see where that one lands. This is what we got so far, y'all. This this what we got so far. I got one right there, one went up there. I think one I was aiming over there, so I turned it back down to here. So I think the majority is right here. I don't know about right here, but the majority is right here. As long as it's not too far, like all the way out here and all the way out there. But like in this black dot is good, but I'm gonna try to keep going for that X right there in the middle so it ain't where I went at the end. But we got a few, but the majority is like right. Like right here, right here. 
So we're gonna shoot these three more and see how it do. Can't see these glasses a little far. Alright, one more bullet, y'all. I don't know where those new ones went y'all i ain't think you know what i'm saying i ain't even gonna capture y'all i don't know where the new ones went but we are hitting somewhere that's that's like around here okay this is where we're hitting good so as long as it's good like that y'all comment down below let me know what y'all think because i'm just getting now getting into this so y'all just gonna have to let me know what y'all think but i think that's straight i did that now i'm on my way back home and i'm gonna talk to y'all when i get to the crib get now for sure right now i am kind of like unprepared for the weather outside literally i don't know what just happened i was looking at these pictures i took right and my mom was pumping gas i don't know my mom never pumped gas you know what i'm saying so i'm just looking i'm like what the heck should get done like what the heck is going on so that so that just happened you know how i was just talking screaming how good the weather felt outside and all that stuff well yeah it, this just happened this just happened man it was literally just 60 now over christmas we got like the biggest snow ever. Literally the biggest snow ever. Mom, mm -hmm. I didn't even notice she was out pumping gas. Oh, because I was using my car. Mm. Yeah, you know, so I hope you guys did have a good Christmas, man. Over Christmas, we literally got the biggest snow ever. Right. Like, what? The snow need to go away, man. You know what I'm saying? Well, actually, wait, hold on, Mom, hold on. Actually, it's like, I'm ready for spring already. What about you, Mom? I am. I'm well, ready for spring. Yeah. Usually I try to, after the first of the year, then I'll be ready. I, I'm honest. Yeah, after the first of the year, like. Yeah. We could go like two, one week into January the most. And after that, it's like, okay, good weather needs to start coming. I'm ready for spring type beat. You know what right. I'm saying? But literally, y'all. We got all this. We got so much snow, the roads are bad. And literally, just in one of the last videos, I was just talking about how good the weather felt. I'm outside. I got me a wash. All that stuff. It was like 60, almost 60 degrees out. Now look at this. <laughs> now look. Right. But it's Michigan. That's how we do it in Michigan. We don't play around. Like the roads is good but bad at the same time. Yesterday they was terrible, but you'll see like side roads and stuff. It's like, you know what I'm saying? I, it's, it's just through. But all this snow. Look at look at all this snow. Literally just like dog. Hey, what? What? Mom, just look, mom. They're not playing that much. Now. <laughs> What's up y'all next day type beat again man and a lot of you guys I wasn't really gonna do this but a lot of you guys has been asking me has been asking me to do a gun collection video and you know that's not the type of stuff I do but at the end of the day what I really want to do is just vlogs and not one certain type of thing so skip it this is what we do man I usually just do vlogs on my life and all that stuff so if this is your first video you might as well just stay tuned subscribe turn the post notifications because I already know the Dilio Martillo. So if you guys did not know, I am I really like guns, but what really started is I'm really big into the war, history, politics, and science. Okay, that's four things I'm really big into. All that stuff, man. One of my very big interests leads to this. So you see, I'm going to do this gun collection video. A lot of you guys have been asking me to do one, and here it is. So it's not going to be too long. It's just going to be quick because I am a beginner. This is really one of my first times just buying guns. And yeah, this is my mini collection. It's only two. It's a beginner collection anyways, all that stuff. So let's get into it. We're going to start with my first gun I bought, which is this JTS MK12 shotgun it's a 12 gauge so you know you see it's an ak variant yeah i i don't i haven't really done a lot of stuff to it i don't know it's just like a shotgun like this is a shotgun i was thinking about doing stuff to it but then like 
you know, I'm just into it. I know it's a rail up here for a sight, but like, what if I wanted a grip down here and stuff? I don't know how the AK ones work, all that stuff. So, yeah, this is basically just a shotgun for the house, really. I was shooting it a lot when I first got it. And it's fun to shoot. Like, I know a lot of people say shotguns aren't that fun to shoot, but they honestly, they, they kind of are. Well, this one was fun to shoot for me because this one has a lot of power. Literally, this one has a lot of power. This boy hit. If somebody got hit with this, they flying away, getting knocked back. Tooth might come out as long as they aren't type beat. You know what I'm saying? This boy has a lot of power. This is a 12 gauge. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, y'all. This is my first gun. It's a shotgun JTS MK12 shotgun. It really wasn't that much. I think it was like 500 I say it was like five, yeah, it was like around 500 AK variant, so it looks just like an AK, but in a shotgun way, which I really like it. And shotguns are super heavy, y'all. Like, literally super heavy. This, for a gun, this is heavy. I mean, like, you know what I'm saying? You can still wear arm, but like for a gun, this is heavy. And it's all not, this back here is light which is crazy to me. This part on the other gun is light back here, but this up here, when you get up here, this this is all heavy, and the heaviest part is right here on a handguard. Like, it, it, this is all heavy right here, but this is my first gun, which is the AK shotgun, man. I don't got no clips of me really shooting it. I think I lost those clips and everything, but yeah, it worked just like an AK. Like, you see the safety and stuff up here. Safety flip this down. That's fire, all that stuff. I don't think it's really loaded like that. I was watching some gun YouTube YouTuber saying if you show them how a gun do something, they demonetize it or something. No, you know how YouTube is, so I want to be extra careful when I'm doing this. So, yeah, y'all. Um, JTS MK12 shotgun. This is my first gun, and I usually just keep this in the house. It's like one of them house shotguns, whatever, protection, all that stuff. But then, okay, we got that. You know, nothing really too much on it. Just, I might add a scope. If y'all think I should do anything to this one right here, comment down below to let me know. I might add a scope, something, figure out how to do a real on AK variants and all that stuff. Y'all just let me know, comment down below. Now, like I said, I'm not gonna make this too long and stuff. This is just gonna be short, mini, kind of quick type beat. You know what I'm saying? Cause I don't really do this, but um, here is my A. R15 Diamondback, so DB15 right here, y'all. And you see, I got the grip, I got the new handguard, I got the new stock, and this sight right here, which isn't bad. So, let's say this. So, for the, the stock was, how much was the stock? Um, Since this is like my beginner gun, it looks sweet and all, but it really, I didn't really spend that much. Honestly, like my handguard, I was just gonna go to the gunsmith because I looked up how to put like a rail handguard. You see, I got the big gas block right here. So I looked up how to put a rail handguard. I do not have those type of tools. I don't, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of work. So I was just gonna go to the gunsmith and I was gonna get like that long rail one that go down and stuff. But they, they gunsmith person was there at the gun range every time I went. So it's like, Whatever, so I just went and I got this handguard. It's the uh, MOE, I think it, yeah, it's the MOE one. And honestly, it was hard to put on my step that helped me with it. So what you, you gotta do is just pull this down and attach the old one. Actually, I got the old one right here. So this is the old one, you know, the ugly stock looking one, whatever, you can't do nothing with this one, but so I pull that down and attach to all that stuff. And this is this one right here. So this handguard was around, how much was this? I want to say 40, 40 or 50 something. And then I got this grip right here. So this grip right here is kind of, it's angled. So it helps better. All that stuff, you know, holding this stuff. I got this for 30 and it's MOE compatible. So I didn't need to get like a rail to put down here, but it's, it fit right in there. It's, Super sturdy, y'all. Literally super sturdy. Then we go to the site. The site was a hundred something. Yeah, it was like a hundred something, one of those. But you know, when I showed y'all I was at the range earlier in the video, I was zeroing it, zeroing it in and stuff. So it's good. And I was accurate, good, all that stuff. And now the stock is 
want to say the stock was like around 50 60 yeah the stock was around 50 60 this is a middle spec stock because this i forgot what they call this i'm a beginner don't horse me but i forgot what they call this but this is a middle spec because this is middle spec right here and yeah and db15 i got a 40 clip in here i got like at least 10 mags some loaded and up loaded up and all that stuff but this is a 40 clip in here i just keep this in here like just at the house and stuff i got some like little range max i use for extra you know what i'm saying i got like three aluminum ones but but yeah so this is my db15 i'm probably going to build it much more but i'm satisfied with this build so far the stock feel way better than the old one so this feels good i like i like uh the hand guard and i like the grip when i shoot too so Honestly, I, I'm pretty satisfied with this build right here. I might keep it like this or I might add a long rail later on in the future. But I'm going with the tan and black look. I still want to add an extra, another pistol grip because I don't like this little middle part right here. So I want to get a new pistol grip. I'll probably get the tan one to go with the black and tan look that I'm doing. And yeah, and y'all see how long the 40 clip is looking there. Like this boy just look huge. Like. But it's honestly not even that bad. Like you see a lot of anti-gun people who be like, AR-15s, all this stuff, they're so heavy. They are so heavy, like they, they this and that. But it's honestly like, you will see all the anti-gun people stuff do is literally easy. Look, I'm, I'm the smallest person you'll probably ever know in it. Keep going. Keep going with it. I'm the smallest person you ever know and I can do that with this. They aren't they aren't that bad. And that's an extra extra weight off the especially this right here. This this boy filled up too. No kidding. Yeah y'all, so this is my beginner's gun collection right here, y'all. I told y'all I wasn't gonna make it long, I was just gonna talk to y'all about it real quick. But what do you guys think? Comment down below how do you feel? Do you which one? Do you like more? Do you like this one or do you like the AR more or DB15 more? I like the DB more because, you know, that boy look hard to me. I'm satisfied with this build, but if I should change it up or do anything else, y'all comment down below. Let me know what I should do, y'all. It's a beginner's build, but I'm satisfied with it. Got my scope zeroed in, all that stuff. And then this one right here, I haven't really done anything to this. So y'all comment down below. Let me know if I should do anything to it or just keep it stock since it's just for the house and stuff y'all so let comment down below and let me know what y'all think on this one y'all but i hope you guys did enjoy this video man i hope i did deliver because you guys have been asking me for a gun collection video for literally the longest and here it is so i hope you guys did enjoy this video man and keep staying tuned subscribe turn on post notifications so you don't miss any more bangers because you already know we got the big bangers you already know the dillio martilio y'all but i'm about to end this video right here so please go down and smash the like button if you guys want more gun videos y'all just gotta smash the like button comment down below that and that's really just gonna let me know that y'all want more i might do more for y'all but if y'all don't then y'all probably just gonna see them in and out the videos as we go along but I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Like, comment, subscribe if you are new. I'm going to catch you in the next one. Let's get it.